Nine months ago, Joker was cremated. I pressed the button and burnt the evil bastard myself. And then, we waited. Gotham braced itself for the inevitable power struggle. But it didn't come. Crime actually fell. Deep down, I knew war was coming. I was just waiting for someone to pull the trigger. Thanks. No problem. Oh, thanks, honey. So, what'll it be? Your usual? Sure. Okay, chicken salad with no dressing. <laughs> no, you know what? Make it waffles. With a side of bacon. Don't tell my wife. Whatever you say, officer. Oh, and if you want some more coffee, just shout. Hey, I'm sorry to interrupt your dinner, Officer uh, Owens. But there's a guy smoking over there in the corner booth. <sighs> Wait here. I'll have a word. No smoking in here. Six point three million people in Gotham City. Today, not so many. The only people left on the streets are the sort that enjoy the chaos. <laughs> Gotham's finest. Scum. Criminals. And worse, not enough good people left to stop them.
It took just 24 hours for us to lose control of the city. Tonight, Gotham's relying on one man to save us all. You made it out okay. Sorry, I've got to go. Stay safe, Barbara. You still know how to make an entrance. How's the evacuation going? Last bus crossed the city limits an hour ago. I'm just glad my little girl got out when she did. Now the real work begins. Any lead on Scarecrow? We were tracking an unknown military vehicle speeding through Chinatown. It's the only lead we've had all night, but they gave us the slip. With the evacuation, I just don't have the manpower left in the city. If you find it, tell your men not to engage. I'll deal with it. Do you really think Scarecrow's crazy enough to detonate a chemical weapon in Gotham? I won't let that happen, Jim. In case you need to reach me, it's going to be a long night. Hey, Batman. Every damn time. Oracle, I need the location of Unit 247. Already working on it. How's my dad doing? He's holding up. Somehow, he always does. Okay, I'm sending through the squad car's location. Be careful. Not looking good out there. safe. Thanks, Batman. I thought they were gonna kill me. The city's overrun. We don't stand a chance. Stay here. I'll send someone to pick you up. What are you doing? Evening the odds. need to track that military vehicle. A squad car has picked up the pursuit. I'm relaying its location now. Call off your men, Jim. Golf Oscar 5-6, this is Commissioner Gordon. I'm calling off the pursuit. 
It's too dangerous. Sir, we're right here. We can take these bastards. What the? They just fired an RPG at us. Who the hell are these guys? Five six, pull back now. That's an order. Let Batman deal with this. Five six have taken a direct hit from an RPG. They're gone, sir. Tim, please, Batman, you've got to stop him. Don't worry, Tim. He's mine. takes care of the vehicle. I need to interrogate the driver and find out what he knows. Where's Scarecrow? Go to hell! Where is he? I got nothing to say to you, Batman. Talk, or I'll crush every bone in your body. Okay, okay! He's working out of a penthouse in Chinatown. I swear that's all I know! If you're lying, I'll break the other one. The other one? Oracle, check the chemical analysis I've just uploaded. Sure. Is this what I think it is? Scarecrow's new toxin. An uncontaminated sample. You're not kidding. I'll prepare a full chemical breakdown on the back computer. What are you going to do? Scarecrow's got a safe house nearby. I'm going to pay him a visit. Let's hope this is the break we've been waiting for. What are you doing here? Why did Scarecrow lock you up? No hello. Tell me. And what if I don't want to? Then I burn every plant in Gotham. It started with a meeting. What meeting? Everyone was there. Penguin, Two-Face, Riddler, even poor Harley. Scarecrow said he had a plan that together we could take you out, and Gotham would be ours. Over my dead body. 
I believe that was the idea. I told him that I wasn't interested in his pathetic human games. And when I came to, I was locked up in that room. It's such a shame that his vile toxin has no effect on me. Nature always wins. Will he ever learn? <sighs> You're coming with me. You only had to ask. What's wrong? Target, sir. He's cornered. Don't move. Are you sure it's him? Confirmed. It's Batman. Sir, that tank they have backing them up is unmanned. Good. I thought this would be tough. All it took was one tank. And we brought an army to take you on. What a waste. This is. Several transport helicopters moving into the city. There are more on the way. Activate the Batmobile weapon diagnostics. It's time to go to war. Level 2, ready. 
Diagnostic test complete. Simulation complete. Batman, I'm seeing a transport deploying more tanks at Panessa Studios. I've warned GCPD to pull their men off the streets. I'm heading there now. Come in, all units. This is Commissioner Gordon. We have numerous hostile tanks deployed across the city. Gotham is under attack. I want everyone off the streets and back to GCPD. We're not equipped to deal with what's out there. Thank God there's someone who is. Any progress with the fear toxin analysis? It's gonna take a little while longer. Drop by the clock tower when you're ready, and I'll show you what I've got so far. Who taught you to drive? Scarecrow's gonna break you, Batman. Honestly, why do you even bother with these meat sacks? Civil unrest? There's a war on the streets. We don't have the manpower or the equipment. Well, look who it is. Ivy. Well, that's one less thing to worry about. Is the isolation chamber ready? Glad you're putting it to good use. Oh, good. Another cell. of this city nobody's coming to help us and the scum out there on the streets will do everything in their power to make sure it stays that way now you all had your chance to evacuate you all made your choices you have my word that each and every one of you will be commended when this is over but the work starts now priority one we're here to save lives and it starts with the lives of your fellow officers right here at this precinct I want a minimum of four guys on the roof at all times and a six-man element patrolling the perimeter. We keep this building locked down. The only people who get in or out are our guys and the Batman. Now, those punks out there think they own this city. And as things stand, they're right. We're outnumbered, outgunned, and understaffed. But if we work smart, we'll get through this and take back the city piece by piece. We have outlying patrols searching for Scarecrow in Bristol, Kingston, Dresher, Otisburg, and Port Adams. We got a half dozen choppers patrolling the skies, but make no mistake, we are not in control. Until we know what we're dealing with out there, until we have a solid lead on Scarecrow, our priority is to dig in here and look out for our own. Any questions? Okay, I'm gonna run through this one more time so we're clear. Priority one, we're here to save lives. You know these walls won't hold me for long. Still, if it makes you feel safer, I'll indulge the fantasy. For now. Element patrolling the perimeter. We keep this building locked down. The only people who get in or out are our guys.
Hey, Batman. I think I'm starting to find Ivy, you know, attractive. Is that normal? I don't remember you being an expert. Okay, I'm gonna run through this one more time so we're clear. Come on, answer the phone, damn it. If you ask me, we should use some of these weapons instead of letting them gather dust. Might even things up a little. God knows we could use the help. Just about. We, the signal's real bad. Are you okay? Detective, I see you've begun pitting that mediocre mind of yours against my riddles. I had plenty of time to conceive them, Batman. It's when you left me battered and demeaned in Arkham City. I am the Riddler, Batman. I don't suffer humiliation. I pay it back. So solve my riddles if you can. They'll be very important later. One stuffed bear in a canister of Titan formula. Owned by Bane, a.k.a. Unknown. <sighs> we had to let Bane loose after the Arkham City fallout. Guy was messed up anyway. Serious Titan withdrawal. My guess, he's off somewhere getting clean. And he's not going to be happy when he comes back. One vial of Titan formula. One set of wind-up explosive false teeth. One pair of actual x-ray specs. One toy gun loaded with one toy flag and five real bullets. All used by the Joker. No known alias. It's one hell of a toy box. I'm glad no one's gonna play with it again. One custom tailored top hat. Worn by Jervis Tetch, a.k.a. the Mad Hatter. Guy's mad, all right. He tried to brainwash Batman in Arkham City. <laughs> he got the Wonderland kicked out of him instead. I hated letting him go. This guy's too creepy to stay free. One ventriloquist dummy, a.k.a. Scarface. This ain't the original Scarface. It's a Joker knockoff. Don't ask me why, but the clown took a liking to these creepy things. One freeze ray. Used by Mr. Freeze, a.k.a. Victor Freeze. We, uh, had to stop playing with this after the commissioner caught us making ice cream. Freeze has kept quiet since leaving Arkham City. Maybe Batman finally talked some sense into him. A selection of body parts belonging to Warren White, a.k.a. the Great White Shark. White got himself sent to Arkham on an insanity plea. He lost a few things other than his mind while there. Made the new look work, though, I gotta say. One mask and jacket worn by Anarchy, a.k.a. Lonnie Machen. I wasn't even a cop when this kid tried to hit Gotham. No one's seen him since. No one knows where they're keeping him. I guess the government don't like anarchists too much. One pair of shock gloves. Worn by the Electrocutioner, a.k.a. Lester Buczynski. Joker hired this guy on the night of the Black Gate riots. And then he killed him. I heard Batman borrowed these for a while before handing them in. I guess he prefers beating up punks the old-fashioned way. One electric charge gun used by Batman, a.k.a. I mean, we don't like to ask. Batman dropped this here with the rest of the Arkham City evidence. Nice to have some of Batman's gear in the evidence room. Ovi doesn't ask for it back. I ain't stopping him. Don't look at me.
I've got a solution. You just don't seem to want to hear it. Screw you. Damn bureaucrats. We're on our own. We can handle it, Jim. What's the latest? We've got incidents cropping up all over the city. Cash, give us a rundown. All right, let's see. First up, we've lost contact with the fire crew from Station 17. We've got their last known coordinates, but they're not going to survive out there on their own for long. Then there's this. It's a strange one. Body turned up. We didn't have long to look before the evacuation, but the forensics boys seem freaked out. Real nasty. Also, we've had several sightings of the Riddler creeping around the train yard. Knowing that guy, he's got to be up to no good. Look, I know you're busy, but anything you can do to help is going to save lives. Don't worry, Jim. I have someone working a lead on Scarecrow. I'll see what I can do. Good to hear. I've got a skeleton crew searching Gotham South and West. I'm gonna join him when I'm done here. We're gonna find that son of a bitch. Fernandez, it's Gordon. Give me an update. I'm going after Riddler. Good luck out there, Batman. Don't worry about Ivy. That cell has her contained. What's the flower girl got to do with Scarecrow? Is she a part of this? I don't know. But I've got a feeling. Yeah, I did too. Doc gave me some cream, and it cleared up in no time. You don't have time. Go in pairs. Watch your backs. If you spot something, call it in. This ain't the time to be a hero. Never seen him up close before. Yep, poor bastard. He ain't gonna be able to live with himself when he finds out what he did in that diner. He's gonna lose his badge for sure. Owens is a good cop, lives for the job. He don't deserve this. What are you doing here, Ryder? Hey, how's my favorite masked vigilante? One of those nights, huh? You shouldn't be in the city. Bet you're wondering about the tape. I'll let you in on the action, if you promise to keep me in the loop. What do you say? It's not safe. You should have left with the evacuation. And missed the biggest story of the year? Hell, the century? This is it. My chance to get back on top. Quid pro quo, Batman. What's the latest on Scarecrow? Any leads? Stay out of trouble. Hey, I try. Trouble always finds me. Tape 8, October 15th. Still no sign of the preacher. No records, nothing. Something tells me he won't stay here so long. Hey, Batman! I guess Scarecrow gave you the slip! You broke my wrist for nothing! Oh! This thing's had a serious upgrade. Air support saw it turn into some kind of tank. Nice. Don't get too close. He's here. Back up. Good evening, Mr. Wayne. I hope the car's performing to your high expectations. Actually, Lucius, he's a little sluggish. I had a feeling you'd say something like that. Give me a few moments, and I'll bring the afterburner function online. Thanks, Lucius. It was good of you to stay behind. You want to thank me, Mr. Wayne? Just try not to hurl off the road. I should have some more upgrades ready soon. Remnants of Gotham, I have messages for you all. To the vandals who stayed behind to pick the still warm flesh from Gotham's bones. Have your fun. You are under my protection. To the cowards quaking behind the police department's walls, you will not be spared. 
And to Batman, I have already won. Emptied your city with a vial of toxin and a few threatening words. That. Why, hello there, detective. Yes, it's me, your most feared nemesis, the Riddler. Congratulations are in order, for you have arrived early for this, the next generation of my riddles. I'm afraid the full particulars of my plan will have to remain unannounced for the time being. But I see no harm in rewarding the harmless little glimmer of initiative you have shown with a sneak peek, a preview, if you will, of the kind of conundrum I have in store. No point getting out. Riddler's plan involves the car. At a mechanism I have calibrated to respond to an extremely precise radar pulse. In a moment, I will give you the decrypted code, Dark Knight. Oh, but first, I think we should run through the ground rules for tonight's festivities. Rule the first. You will address me at all times as Riddler, the Riddler, or Mr. Nigma, sir. What? What? How did you... How, how did you... Solve tonight's very first riddle. <laughs> well done. Well done. Welcome to my racetrack, detective. You must complete three circuits of this gauntlet, finishing each before the time limit expires. Come now, detective. Let's put that grotesque ego-mobile to the test. Be ready, Dark Knight. There's more to this test than just going vroom, vroom, really fast. Tick-tock, detective. Tick-tock. Faltering synapses keep up with my automatically adjusting force. I'm disabling the afterburner's failsafe. I need the extra speed. I'm shocked, Dark Knight. Is that really as fast as it goes? Let's work that undeveloped brain of yours. Go left. You're close, detective. Don't fumble now. Don't fumble now. Dark Knight, I'm stunned, humiliated, utterly bested. Time I gave up, I think. Why don't you head on your way? <laughs> Did you really believe that a challenge designed by me, the Riddler, would be quite so easy? Oh, Dark Knight. 
You sweet, naive sentinel. Of course it wouldn't. Still, thanks to your unrelenting desire to showboat, I now have several hundred terabytes worth of performance data relating to that latest model of rocket-powered hearse you're driving. Naturally, I shall be using this data to calibrate further challenges and trials. I'll see you soon, Detective. There's a lot more to come. The missing fire crew's not safe on these streets. I'll start by checking Dixon Dock West. That was their last reported location. Batman. God, it's really you. What happened here? Our, our truck was attacked. Riders dragged us out one by one. We were separated, taken away. Please, they're gonna kill us. I'll save your crew. Wait here. I'll get a GCPD officer to pick you up. Killed, mutilated, and posed a body on Merchant Bridge. If I'm going to stop them, then I need to investigate the crime scene for clues. I found the mutilated body Cash was talking about. I'm going to try and establish a cause of death. Blood tests reveal the cause of death was an overdose of painkillers leading to cardiac arrest. Also, the victim's fingerprints have been burned off with acid. A rather unsavory demise. That's not all. It's as though the subject's DNA has been corrupted somehow. There's insufficient information for me to cross-reference the database. I'll have to use the deep tissue scanner to analyze the body for distinguishing features and determine the victim's identity. Right you are, sir. Deformity on the left ear. Looks like a result of minor ear agenesis, a birth defect. A wedding ring in the lower intestine. The inscription reads, Ophelia. The victim had a hip replacement. Scar tissue hasn't fully healed, so it must have been recent. Alfred, 
The victim's name is Anthony Lund. Hospital records show he suffered with alcoholism, most probably brought on by the breakdown of his marriage. The name on the ring, Ophelia, his ex-wife. He was last seen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. What's unusual is that they didn't go missing in Gotham. They were brought here and killed. Why? We need to track down whoever did this. Might I suggest keeping an ear out for any more of that ghastly opera music? It sounds ominously like a calling card. I'm heading to the clock tower to see what Oracle's found on the Scarecrow's box. Let's hope it's good news, sir. to stop this killer, I should analyze the body I found on the rooftop of the Gotham Herald. Alfred, I found another body. The mutilation pattern looks to be identical to the previous murder victim. Then it appears Gotham does indeed have a serial killer in its midst. And here I was thinking this evening couldn't get any worse. I'm going to scan the body for unique identifiers. Scar tissue on the upper arm. I recognize the pattern. 20 years ago, this was a badge of honor among inmates at Blackgate Penitentiary. A small group of racketeers known as the Bloodhaven Six. Remnants of a pacemaker fitted through the right ventricle. If I cross-reference the manufacturer with the pacing method, it will help to narrow the search. Clear signs of bone deformation on the victim's knee. Joint line sclerosis points to juvenile arthritis, a rare and debilitating condition. Alfred, I've ID'd the victim as Franklin Ocargo. His records are a litany of drug-related offenses, sir. In and out of prison from an early age. He was serving a 20-year sentence at Blackgate before being released early on grounds of ill health due to a heart condition. He moved to Little Rock, Arkansas, which is where he was reported missing. Another person taken from outside the Gotham area. A significant detail, sir. So are these words written beside the bodies. Try and find a connection between the two victims I've found, Alfred. There has to be something linking them together. I'll try my best, sir. I come in the Batcave, start messing with all your stuff? You've managed to reduce the compound to its core elements. But there's nothing in there that we can trace. What if we'd been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of searching for the toxin, what if we focus on the manufacturing process? Why didn't I see this? 
the reaction emits a unique radiation spike. Run a scan of the city for this energy signature. It will show where Scarecrow is creating a sphere toxin. It'll take a few hours to bring the satellites into position. We don't have enough time. I'll repurpose the antenna at the movie studios. Bruce, I spoke to Dad. I hate lying to him. He'd kill me if he knew I was still in the city. He still blames himself for this. We'll stop, Scarecrow. Jim, we've got a way to find out where Crane's working from. Thank God. What can I do? Get your men ready. Soon as we've got a location, I'll let you know. All right. Damaged. I need to bypass it and power the antenna directly. Hello again, Mr. Wayne. How can I help you this time? Is the power winch ready for deployment? It's 100% functional. Though no guarantees if you're intending to pull that car of yours up the side of a building. You read my mind. It's in the job description, Mr. Wayne. Batwing's on its way. Improvise. The winch needs a secure anchor point to function. Once it's attached, just hit reverse. And please be careful with the car, Mr. Wayne. She's one of a kind.
Oracle. I've restored power to the radio antenna. Great. I'm connecting now. I was just talking to Robin. I think you should, too. Bruce, you need me out there. We can find Scarecrow faster together. What you're working on is more important, Tim. You can wait one night. Let me help. I've got this under control. <sighs> okay. Listen, try checking in once in a while. We're partners, remember? He just wants to help, you know. Is the antenna ready? Yeah, but we're going to need a microwave tower to triangulate Scarecrow's location. There's one at Falcone's shipping in the cauldron. I've marked it on your map. Thanks, Oracle. <laughs> 